Hi, this is Dan from AppLand. I'm going to demonstrate the quick and easy setup of the app map integration for Python using the code for the Chicago Python Users Group website as an example. The first step is to install the app map plugin from the JetBrains marketplace. Then install the app map Python package with pip install app map. The AppMap framework uses a file called appmap.yml to determine which code to instrument. You should add all the source folders of your project. Now I'm ready to record an AppMap. AppMap works by recording code execution paths of your app. A good way to create AppMaps is by recording functional or integration test cases. This project uses PyTest, which will be a source of AppMaps. So to get a recording, I will run a test with the environment variable app map equals true. Here are the app maps for the test that I just ran. This is the dependency map. I can explore web services, code, and SQL. I can drill down into a detailed execution trace, into source code, and back again. If you want to include third-party libraries in your app map, then add them to appmap.yml using the keyword dist. Here's how to map Django itself. When I rerun the test and check the app map, you can see Django code is now included in the map. As you can see, this process is quick and easy. Once you've set it up, you can commit and push these configuration changes and anyone on your team can take advantage of this workflow by installing the app map extension for PyCharm. To give us feedback, visit us in Discord or find us on Twitter at Land of Apps, all one word. You can find full usage instructions and all these links on the app map page in the JetBrains marketplace. And you can find more information about AppLand along with more videos at AppLand.com. Thanks for watching.